The state government rollout of parking fees at public hospitals is continuing to outrage patients and staff. What's been branded as penny pitching will raise $11 million a year for the slashed health budget, notwithstanding today's technical hitches. The message was loud and clear. No way, we won't pay. No way, we won't pay. Modbury Hospital and Hampstead Rehabilitation Centre are charging patients and visitors up to $13 a day for parking. Some visitors to Modbury Hospital tried to avoid the fees by parking several blocks away. Very disappointing. Like, I can understand if I was coming shopping, but not into a hospital. And she's dying with cancer. What a blow to pay to come to visit your rallies. Ooh, not good. Even some patients joined the protest. It is hard on them because it, it, they have to come a long way. Health authorities say the fees bring the hospitals in line with others that already charge for parking. Modbury Hospital staff were on hand to help explain the changes, but there was confusion when some machines failed. Not working. I don't know. I guess it's not working. Full-time hospital staff get reduced rates of $2 a day and casuals get some concessions. But some argue it's a matter of principle. I'm actually protesting and not paying myself. I'm going to be parking out in the streets, which is a real concern when I do a late shift and have to walk around in the dark at night. There will be an upgrade to lighting at some locations. There will be also um, a video surveillance to improve security. And we're also increasing the car parking spaces at Hampstead. Four other hospitals will introduce parking fees from next month. Robin Powell, ABC News, Adelaide.